Here's a real simple play from Washington State. A uh, quick screen that is mirrored up with their inside zone that they run quite a bit. Uh, right here against Houston, uh, what they end up doing is, is showing inside zone. Uh, they always have their back cross right here. Sometimes this tackle will pass it before he gets out, but sometimes he'll step down like he's going inside zone and then uh, go out, especially against a five technique. He'll zone it and then he'll go out. Uh, right here, they, they're throwing it to the number two receiver. He's running a tunnel, blocking right there. He knows he's got number three because uh, they're going to switch what they have right there. The center and guard, uh, either zone or pass set, and they get out. we got an alley player right there, and then he's coming and rat killing backside. And we'll look at it right there, faking a cross. Really good against, you know, you have a four eye or a four uh, with that three front free completion right there. He's getting out to lead. There's a big alley right there. These guys are working that direction. You can see how that linebacker's flowing right there with the inside zone action, uh, getting a completion and a good alley right there for uh, a good play right there by that center with the rat kill and then uh, getting the ball in space right there, slowing people down on that inside zone. Uh, really good, especially if you have a team that's just squeezing and sitting on the inside zone. Hopefully it will encourage those guys to get up field, and then you can uh, hit it backside uh, to that C gap. Those guys get up field trying to knock down those throws. Here's another good look against Houston. Uh, they're in a two-back set. They're throwing this tunnel out here to the number one receiver. And what this play side tackle does, he actually pass sets against the five technique. Once he gets about even with them, he swats them and pushes them and tries to uh, get him up field. And then there's the throw right there to the alley. He's getting out for number two. Right there, you're going to kick, and here's this guard getting out here to lead. Uh, not quite the most accurate ball, but right there, rolling into that alley, getting getting inside that block, and then getting back outside if at all possible. Uh, great job by those guys getting out in space, uh, those linemen playing in space. Uh, but right there, faking zone to the right, trying to get those linebackers to flow that direction, then throwing that tunnel back the other way and getting those uh, linemen out there in space for a big play. Here's a similar play in Washington State's game against Iowa State. Uh, what's a little bit different is these guys just pass that instead of the inside zone. He's still faking the inside zone that direction. Uh, they're going that direction. He actually slips out and then he rat kills. He's to the alley. He's blocking right there. He tries to go inside out right there for a safety rolling down uh, or back or whatever you'd classify that guy as. Right there, he's trying to get this in, let him go. He gets upfield, uh, just gets a, just a fake right there. This is a little bit tougher uh, side to throw it right here. Uh, just getting a fake. And he's throwing off balance right there off his back foot. Uh, but it's a short throw with a guy coming to you. Uh, probably going to take a little bit off that ball as well and make it a, an easier catch. Uh, but right there, there's a lot of space. You can see there's really no alley player. That number 33 right here, uh, that, that safety he's dropping. Right there, he's going to take him. He's coming to the alley, or he's coming to really kick, and then he's getting to the alley, but there's nobody to kick. And then he, right here is the center, and he's rat killing, knowing that these guys are going to end up going that direction trying to cut off the screen. You can see these guys are in space with nobody to block. Uh, so right there, they're looking for work and do a great job getting on guys. I uh, just thought it was a really interesting look, throwing this screen to the right. A uh, little bit more difficult for the quarterback if you can throw off balance a little bit and be accurate like he is right here. Uh, pretty solid play. Uh, again, getting the ball in space, getting the lineman out in front, and trying to hold those guys for that and showing inside zone away from especially with that back action and then getting the ball in space. There's a couple more clips from this uh, past year that I thought were pretty good. And this is a clip against Oregon. And we'll just kind of play it and see exactly what takes place. It looks like those guys are passing, just getting a quick set. And then they're releasing, getting their guys out in space. And just, again, faking inside zone with the backs, getting the ball out there. Uh, a lot of space, a lot of guys giving ground. So they're getting it out there. And right there you stop it. And you got three guys out there. One of them should be rat killing to, to close that off, but he doesn't. He's just getting out there in front and you know getting the ball in space here's another good look from this game and the reason why i like it you got that wide five over here to this side that they're running the screen and you can see what the tackle does he just sets and lets him rush and then he swats him on the back trying to get him to stumble a little bit make it an easier throw for the quarterback and that's what he does he gets him he gets his uh hands down and everything just with that little swat and he's off balance quarterback just getting the ball out uh, going to the left is pretty pretty easy. Going to the right is probably a little bit more difficult. But uh, right there, good accurate ball, putting it on our chest, and we got three guys out in front.